Hey y'all, welcome back to the shop. This is Terry. Today we're uh, back on a project in our Momentum 31G. And uh, these are brand new, brand new on the market. We're gonna be putting on the Lippert screen assist handle today. And uh, as soon as I saw these uh, online, I, I, I bought them for both the, the garage door and the main door for the, for the 31G. I, I don't know about y'all, but Several different times during most camping trips, I hear these words. Uh, hey, babe, could you get the door for me? Um, especially when Cheryl's coming in and out, cooking on the Blackstone, doing whatever with her hands full. And this is going to solve that problem. So th this is going to be a lever, um, a, a long lever that will go across the screen door and will actually you just push down on the lever and it, it'll open it up. So it's absolutely super simple install. Uh, really easy project. And uh, I have all the I have the links to uh, to get these from Lippert, of course, down in the show notes. Uh, all you're going to need is uh, you need a screw gun or, or, or equivalent with a number two square drive on it. And uh, I will tell you that if you're an RV owner and you don't have a number two square drive of some sort, you best get one because a lot of screws in RVs are these take this bit. Uh, a lot, a lot of people look at them, they think they're Torx bits because they're sort of star shaped, but they're not. They're a double square, uh, and this is the correct bit for them. It is a number two square drive. Got a tiny little screwdriver, maybe even the point of your pocket knife. Uh, you'll see where, where that application will come in in just a minute. I have just a regular Phillips screwdriver to uh, change the handles out. And you need something that you, that you can mark with. I'm just going to use the trusty number two pencil. A nice instructions here. We're going to replace the uh, the lever on the screen door with this lever, and let me let me see if I can show you this. I want to show you in here, so when we get out out to the 31G, you won't have to wonder what I'm doing. But this right here, this this is a little insertion line, and what's going to happen here is this is actually going to slide on here, and when we get ready to mark our length out there. We're, that that's how we're going to mark it. So we're going to go up to this insertion line uh, so everything works freely. So I just want to show you that while we're in here. Uh, Lippert has uh, given, given us the components to actually make this just a solid bar. Uh, we already have one of those crossbar uh, handles on each one of our screen doors, but if you want it just to be a, a bigger handle on the screen door, which I highly recommend uh, also, then they have the the hardware in here to do that um, or in this configuration that we're going to have it. So uh, great little product, super easy install and uh, let's reconvene back at the 31G in just a minute. All right, and here we are in the 31G and uh, first thing we're going to do is we're just going to remove this um, original lever, take our tiny screwdriver and pull this plug out. Don't need, that, don't need that anymore anyway. We have another one to go in. Take out the screw. All right, whenever you remove this, it's a little bit snug. And the one going back on is a little bit snug as well. It, it, it will fall out if you don't hold it um, on the back side. So you want to do that. It, it's, it's a, there's a square on the inside. Hopefully y'all can see that. I know it's not going to focus very well, but... You'll see when you get there. Super easy. It just goes on just like that. And like I said, it's a little bit of a snug fit in there. Just put our screw in there and tighten it up. Okay. Just like that on that part. Easy enough. Okay, we're going to take our ends and uh, we're going to slide our ends on here. So this is the one, obviously it's gonna go there. We have this and this little bracket that need to snap together. And we'll do that just like that. Put these together. All right, we'll need our pencil. So now this, this little line that you can't see now that I showed you earlier is gonna come into play. So we, uh, we're gonna put our end right here lined up with with the uh, insertion line and get relatively parallel here. We want our holes back here 
to be right in the center of this. So once we have this, and that looks just about perfect right there. I'm going to look on the inside here and make for sure we're still good. Yes. All right. Once we have this uh, to the length that we need it, and relatively parallel, and I'm just going to make a little mark with my pencil on each one of these. And you can see just a little mark right there. And on the inside, there are holes for screws here. If I would hold that up, it would be awesome. There are screws for holes holes for screws here and uh, they Lippert has provided self tapping screws there so we're just going to take the screw gun and uh, make sure that we have our, our our marks lined up and run our screws in here uh, I'm going to I'm going to do that over on the counter and we'll be right back with this and we'll show you the rest of the install all right we're back and uh, we, we've got the rest of our install done here and uh, but before I forget it I, I I did forget to put the little plug back in the hole, so uh, Lippert sends you another one uh, to go in there, so you actually have two. But anyway, I want to put your little screw plug back in there. And just a matter of uh, making sure we're parallel here, running your two self tappers in to hold this. Um, I will say that be easy here because it would be really easy to strip those out. They're little screws, you're going into aluminum screen door, so. Definitely would be, you know, pretty easy to strip these out. So don't want to do that. And uh, but once you're there, you're done. I mean, that's all there is to it about it. And th this is just to me is just going to be the coolest thing. Uh, it just so much easier than having to deal with the look, with finding the little lever or whatever. So uh, like I said, I, I just I think it's just going to be a, a cool little addition and uh, super simple install. And uh, like I said, the, the links for these will be down in the show notes. And uh, as always, thank, thank you for watching. Uh, subscribers, thank you so much for subscribing. Uh, hit the like button. Uh, it really helps us with YouTube. And uh, we'll see you next time with a new project.